My name is Craig McClellan um, and my wife Gina McClellan and we've been at Westridge since um, 2000 and we actually started going to Westridge right when we started dating and then we've been going to Westridge ever since. Our oldest son is 20 years old. His name is CJ. We have two other boys, Owen, who's 15, and Jet, who's 12. When CJ was in sixth grade, we had heard about Rush. We knew about Rush from the several years that we had been in Rush beforehand, but he was finally aged to go and stuff, so we were super excited to be able to send him and give him the opportunity to grow in Christ. And every time he came back from Rush, there was a series of conversations and you know all of these moments of prayer and enlightenment. And this, this young man is growing for that week that he's at the beach. So I mean, it was a great opportunity for him to go and, and bond with others. But there was something inside of me that did not really want to send our second child when he became age. Our family takes a trip with his boss. We don't know if we're going until we get the invitation to be included, and that's usually around May. But I knew that if we signed them up and then we got the invitation to go on this vacation, then they needed to go to Rush and because we had invested that money into it. So we didn't, but I think also I wanted that time with the boys. So I feel like my heart was really selfish. As far as Rush, I always had the idea or the thought process of, I'm fine with the kids going to Rush. I, would be, I think it would be great for Owen or Jet to have the same experience that CJ was having and the spiritual growth that we're seeing from CJ. So I didn't have reservations. My reservation was God putting my heart in a place where I need to support my wife. For two years, my two youngest boys did not attend, did not go to Rush. and. The registration for last year is coming open and they send the email, get the email from Student Ministries and Todd that says, last two weeks, make sure you get signed up. And I remember immediately just sending Craig a message saying, what do you think? But he sends back a message immediately, sign him up, sign Owen up. I'm not sure that was the answer I wanted. He said, it's fine, sign him up. I'll go with them. I'll sign up and volunteer. And I thought, okay, that's a little bit better. Me and Owen and Jet and CJ have been praying about it, talking about it. I knew his heart was ready. If she, her heart was ready enough for her to send me that email, then God was working on her heart. I started to become aware of the fact that maybe the Lord is doing a work here. And then that evening I find out that our oldest son, CJ, has decided he's gonna volunteer. I have a fear of going, but a longing to go too. In the end, by the time registration was supposed to cut off, both of the middle school boys were signed up. Oldest son had signed up, and then the two of us signed on to volunteer, and we were on our way. I loved being around and seeing all of these children there for the purpose of learning about God. It just was such a blessing to see a united front of the church itself loving on these kids. The week wraps up and we come home together and all of us pausing to hear the other one share the ways that we were touched and moved and the things that God did was just mind blowing. In the end, going to Rush, God exceeded our expectations and blessed us with tremendous family time with one another. But I can tell you the spiritual growth and the bonding that we had as a family was something you just can't duplicate. That was just a God thing. This was an opportunity for um, kids to really grow in their walk, grow in their relationships. There was so much shared just in that moment. We all knew that the, what happened over that week could have only been God, and it was ordained by God. It was pulled together by God. It couldn't have happened by anything that we chose, and it's changed our summer moving forward. Our summers are never going to be the same.